Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. Let us solve today's DC using Python programming language. The program must accept an integer n, then the program must accept n integers as output and it also should accept an integer x. Then the program must print sorry then the program must print x lines The first line contains first integer, second line contains next two integer, and the third line contains Next three integers. Similarly, we have to print x lines. The program must accept an integer n and also n integers and also an integer x as input. Then the program must print x lines. The first line contains first integer, second line contains next two integers, finally the third line contains next three integers. Similarly, the program has to print up to x lines, where the integers are printed in a circular manner. Now, Let's check for our test case. This is our first test case. Uh, n is equal to 10 here. So we are getting 10 input from the user and 13 is x. So 13 lines are printed. First line contains 83, second line contains uh, 2 digits and third line contains uh, 3 integers. Similarly so on and it is printed in a circular manner. Seventh line, eighth line, ninth line, tenth line. Now let's consider for our second test case. Here n is equal to 3, we are getting 3 inputs from the user and x is equal to 10. So 10 line is printed as output. First line contains 1, 2, 3, likewise so on. It is also printed in a circular manner. Hope you guys understood this logic. Now let us implement our logic in Python programming language. The program must accept an n as an input integer. So n equal to int of input. And we are using an array here. List of map of int of input dot split. And it must accept an integer x. x is equal to int of input. Let's have a variable called start index equal to 0, which is the starting index of the number to be printed for CTR in range 1 comma x plus 1 first line to the x -th line. So we are using check value here 1 comma x plus 1 for index in range start index comma start index plus CTR 
here start index for the first line start index is 0 and start index plus ctr is 1 so 0 comma 1 so you have to print array of index comma n equal to space now we must increment the start index start index equal to start index plus ctr for the second line it must print two integers so we must increment it with ctr and we are using modulo n here to print it in a circular manner and in here also you have to use modulo n error of index of modulo n and finally we must print a new line here so print now let's run our test case running our code hence we get we got the required output two integers three integers four five and so on up to 13th line let's run our second test case hence we got the required output 10 lines are printed as a output our program has passed all our given test cases successfully Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.